Thank you for coming to my channel. Now I do have a phone here for us. Uh, this is my LG V60. As you can see right here, we have a V60. V60 ThinQ. And I was on the phone yesterday with Q-Link Technical Support because they sent me a new SIM card and once I inserted my new SIM card after they told me to reset the network, I could not make any phone calls. It was showing that I had had like 4G LTE. Eventually it did connect to 5G. I am unable to make phone calls as I'm um, let me cut one for voicemail and I'll call it and you'll see what happens. Put it this way, I talked to technical support yesterday. They kept on changing settings and stuff on their side and different things. And then eventually they came back telling me my phone was not compatible with the, with their services, that I had to buy a new phone. And this is the top of the line LG phone that they currently have out. I'm sure they're gonna come out with a new one eventually. But if you look here, it says mobile network unavailable out of service area. When you try to make phone calls, I found out how to fix this on my own. Technical support didn't even try to tell me to go into any of my settings to try to change any settings. If I come into settings and I click on where it says network and internet, mobile networks, if you look here where it says allow 2G service, it is not turned on. As soon as you turn on 2G service, and if you look here, it says to set some apps and features working in locations with limited cellular coverage. Okay, I turn that on. I come back over, I press one to call voicemail. Welcome to your voicemail service. Para español, o prima uno. As you can see, it actually works. I will be helping you set up your voicemail in three easy steps. Creating a As you can see, the voicemail now works. I'm able to call voicemail. I wasn't able to make any phone calls before at all. Now I can make phone calls. After Q-Link Technical Support told me, your phone is not compatible, and they wanted me to buy one of their phones. And all it was was one simple setting where I had to enable the 2G so it could make phone calls. It seems like it does the data with the 5G tower, but it wants to make phone calls using the 2D, uh, the 2G towers. So once I enabled that, I am now able to use my phone and make phone calls. So I really didn't need a new phone like they were trying to talk me into buying. And of course, I wouldn't want their cheap $20 phone that they offer. Uh, I would have wanted one of their more expensive phones because I don't want a phone that has limited space. And you know how loaded the LG V60 is. And of course, this uh, uses the T-Mobile network whenever you're using Q-Link Wireless, which now gives you 5G speed. And there are, and this is like that free phone you get through uh, the government and welfare service for Q-Link Wireless. This I believe will work most likely with other self uh, with other T-Mobile issues as well. I'm guessing most likely. It'll most likely work on other phones too if you're having this issue. You just need to figure out where your settings are for the mobile networks and enable the 2G. Well, I'd like to thank you for viewing this video. Remember to click like and subscribe. Peace.